the complement of the complement of a product of product of variables variables is equal to the sum of sum of the complement complements of the variable variables that is that is this is the uh, uh, one law of uh, de morgan's the complement of a uh, product of variables is equal to the sum of the complements of uh, variables so that is uh, you can write here the product of the variable suppose that the x and y is two variables x and y is two variable and it's the product that means x and y and then it's the complement so writing here so product of two variables and its complement this is equal to this is equal to sum of a complement of the variables this one is equal to x bar plus of y bar so this is the de morgan's first one law yes so just to remember this point so what is the de morgan's law product of a variable complement is equal to sum of the complement of a variable or you can say uh, the complement of two or more and gate or you can say the complement of two or more and gate or, or, or you can say the complement of or, or uh, you can say that one uh, the complement of the complement of the complement of two or two or more uh, and gate two or more and gate variables variables is equal to is equal to the the or of the or of the complement complements of the individual variable individual variables individual variables that is that is uh, suppose i am writing here uh, two or more and variables like uh, suppose x y and z so more than two variables and all are and and means a product and it's the complement it's the complement that is you can say uh, it's the complement is equal to or or means sum sum of uh, individual sum of uh, individual variable complement so that is equal to x bar plus y y bar plus z bar and so on so this is a uh, one of the law of uh, de morgan's theorem now we discuss the second law second law of uh, de morgan's theorems so for the second law of the de morgan's theorem the complement of the complement of the complement of a uh, sum of variables sum of variables is equal is equal to the product of the product of the complement of the variables 
variables that is that is so sum of the variables suppose x and y is a two variable it's a sum sum means x plus y these two variable and it's the complement this is equal to this is equal to the product of the complement of variable so what is the product of the complement so that is equal to x into y x into y bar x into y bar yes the sum of the variables and its complement is equal to product of the complement of these variables so this one is the second law of uh, de morgan's theorem second law of uh, de morgan's theorem so these Uh, theorems are very important for a uh, minimizations of a uh, uh, any uh, boolean functions boolean functions boolean functions or you can say uh, say uh, the complement of you can you can say uh, the complement of in the other way you can define this one the complement of excuse me sir complement of yes सर इन द प्रीवियस स्लाइड आई गेस वो अलग अलग होगा ना तो प्रोडक्ट में कॉम्प्लीमेंट सर क्योंकि वो सेटिस्फाई नहीं हो रहा है अगर वन एक वन हुआ और एक जीरो हुआ सर इसमें सर एक्स वाई शुड बी डिफरेंट कॉम्प्लीमेंट नॉट सर द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड इन द नेक्स्ट दिस वन यस सर इन दिस वन द एक्स वाई एक्स डॉट वाई व्हिच इज रिटन शुड बी डिफरेंट दिस थ्योरम यस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल नाउ आई मे एक्सप्लेन दैट वन ओके सर So just a bit. So De Morgan's second uh, second law is the complement of a sum of variable is equal to the product of the complement of a variables. Or generally we can define just a generalize that one. If uh, the complement of the complement of two complement of two or more two or more or gate so or two or more or uh variables variables is equivalent to equivalent to the equivalent to the end of the complement of complement of the individual individual variables individual variables that is that is so two or more uh, more than two variables uh, so suppose i am taking here the x plus y plus z so three variables i am taking and it's the bar, bar this is equal to x y and z bar yes so this one is the complement uh, of this values so this one is the de morgan's first law and second law is that clear or anyone have any doubts any query is that clear or anyone have any doubts any query sir it should be individually complemented na so you are complementing yes. whole product but in the definition yeah, it is written individually yeah 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 this one is individually uh, just a minute so this is not a, this is individually complement yes sir that's so complement of this into this into this clearly here <clears throat> this one is the individually complement not a whole complement in the complement of x into complement of y yes sir max so this this one is the de morgan's uh, uh, law yes so how to apply the de morgan's uh, how to apply the de morgan's law just uh, just i'm uh, saying so using a de morgan's law you can simplify a uh, uh, simplify uh, any boolean, uh, boolean expressions now for example just now i'm taking a one example suppose a uh, a uh, question is uh, compress this one uh, apply apply de morgan apply 
डी मॉर्गन्स थ्योरम थ्योरम टू द एक्सप्रेस टू द एक्सप्रेस सॉरी टू द to the expressions of first one is uh, w x y and z and it's the bar and uh, second one is uh, suppose w plus x plus y plus z and it's the bar just to simplify this one so what is the solution of this one so what is, how to express using a de morgan's and how to express this one is the using a de morgan's So according to De Morgan, the product of uh, the variable and its the complement is equal to. Just to remember like this one. Uh, here the product. So in this side sum, and here the whole bar. So individual bar. So W plus X bar plus Y bar plus Z bar. And here the concept is plus and whole bar. So 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 you can convert this one. Uh, this one as a. a uh, product in individual bar so w into x into y into z bar so in this way you have simplify uh, you can apply a de morgan's theorem now 